Hello. I've downloaded Linux Mint 22.3 Xena Beta just to take a look at the menu here and, and uh, see what it looks like. We want to experiment with that just a little bit and uh, we'll bring up the terminal here and try to make this larger here if we can and we'll do a Neo Fetch so you can see that we are running 22.3 uh, before I started, I used to try to make my panel blue, but under this menu, it doesn't doesn't really please me that well. It doesn't do what I think it should. We'll go to System Settings here, and we'll go to Themes. And of course, I'm running on a jump drive, so it's going to run kind of slow. I am running in the live iOS. Um, So let's see here. This is the one I used to run. I used to run, I think it's called something like Railway. So we're going to go ahead and download that. And I should have just went back one, shouldn't I? Okay, we'll go back into it. We're going to choose Railway, and that gives us a nice uh, blue menu bar. But this looks terrible. The highlight, the dark against all that light, just doesn't work. So I've definitely got to do something different from that. And uh, I used to choose like the X Aqua here, I think. That gives my icons of what I think is a much better look. See the fire world there on Firefox. I like the look of that. Uh, but anyway, we're going to try to make this look even better before we go to experimenting. So what we're going to do is we're going to... Uh, I found out this one I like pretty good. And uh, we'll type in Willow. Yeah, I like this. Cinemox Willow Grove. We're going to download that one. And we're going to go back and we will try this one out. Yeah, it took a while for it to grow on me, but I like this one here really well. Uh, yeah, I like that. And uh, what we can do here is try to pull these icons over a little bit here. Let's go into uh, panel edit mode. Let's see if we can hook these and pull them over sometimes. It takes a while, but some, sometimes I can catch it first time, but usually not. I really don't know what the trick is here, but after so long time I struggle with it, I usually get it there. Okay, now that we want to go out of panel edit mode. There, now I like that. See, the, the, the darker don't look all that bad on that real soft green. Looks pretty pretty professional and pretty elegant I think we got our nice round corners here we got our space here where the menu is and uh, this comes factory now this comes from from the uh, from the programmers with this menu bar on the bottom remember I used to always struggle and, and uh, change the coding on the mit on the menu to, to get it down there but uh, now then they will allow you to they will allow you they allow you to do it just from a switch so uh, <clears throat> let's go to configure and uh, you can go to appearance and uh, right here at the bottom you can put it at the top choose put it at the top there it is at the top uh, you can put the uh, power buttons alongside the search bar. So you can put them there if you like. So I know a long time ago I said that I would like to have this just so there can be a switches, you know, so it can be switched. I'll try to let you 
listen to part of that video. It was something like Linux Mint uh, 22.1, I think. I made a video on my wish list, and that was one of them. And I'll see if I can find that video. I cut part of it here so you could hear it. Hopefully this is it. Nope, that's not it. Where is the video? Right here. But, uh, what wouldn't it be nice if you could just click right here and right click and choose configure? And wouldn't it be nice if there was a switch right here to put search bar on the bottom? You can see that there is a top. I, I think that would be really, really, really neat. So I asked for that some time ago in my video. I must not have been the only one because they sure put it in there. Uh, they did. And if you want to move this to the bottom, of course, you can uh, right click on that LM and choose configure and uh, choose appearance. And uh, you can put this at the bottom and still keep your your start button your power buttons over there beside it see now it's on the bottom over there that's kind of neat too that's not so bad and uh, you could actually turn this over here off I went through a lot of things I'm not sure if I can remember exactly how to do it but you can actually turn this off with a setting uh, content um, sidebar right here you can turn sidebar off if you want there there's sidebar turned off that's not too bad but I'm used to getting my my package manager from over here so <clears throat> and my uh, settings grabbing them from over here so that really wouldn't work for me but that that's not too bad of a setup uh, let's see here we'll turn them back on And we will go to appearance. And we will put this back where it belongs, where I like it, in the sidebar. And leave that at the bottom. And then I like to put in my text here, <coughs> on, my, on my panel bar, the uh, version of Linux that I'm using of Linux Mint. Linux Mint. Cinnamon uh, 22.3 and it is, hope I pronounced this right, Xeno. See, so I got this down here just like that and I like that very well. But something I didn't expect is I was a uh, able to get rid of some of these white boxes to see how white that is and another thing I wanted to do while I was in here we want to change this background just change the background to just about anything besides all that dark I'm just not uh, a fellow that likes a lot of dark on his desktop there we'll even take that green over that it'll look too bad with on this screen too so but uh what I decided to do when I was working on this was uh, this 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 willow is got a setting in it where you can, it'll actually change your some of your text boxes too. This Cinemox Willow Grove, you can we'll change this to a, like a minty Y. Let's see, is that the one we want? Yeah, teal's a little light. Teal's just a little bit too much blue. So we'll go with minty Y. So I think minty X. That ain't too, that's not too bad. Let me see what I've decided to go with over here. Yeah, we'll go with minty X. It looks a little bit lighter. But here... We actually got an, a, a Willow's Grove button setting. So that's really neat. When you hit that, uh, yeah, see, really good things happen. So now then we have changed our text boxes even 
even our uh, even our foul manager. So yeah, I like that. Gets rid of a lot of that white. And uh, change that around so you got a nice green highlight bar. And I like that well. Just put some of my in here on one, but I I don't know. I've I've I've, I've waited so long for this. Uh, it seems like, but uh, and I like this, and I I found this that works in the old menu too. I think I'm gonna stick with the old version. I'm I'm usually really quick to upgrade. I like tinkering with my computer, and and I like what Linux Mint does in the future. And I don't dislike this one, but uh, when I was when I was experimenting today. I got that other, I got the 22.2 menu looking really good the way I like it. So I'll try to show you a picture of that. So I'm not for sure if I'm just going to upgrade right away. Because I this right here I can't get rid of. Maybe you can tell me how. That black in here, that real dark collar there. And my black highlighter bar. I can get a nice green one up here. And I can get a green one over here. But I can't get green here. And I just don't like those real dark collars here it looks okay but I really wish I had the option maybe you can tell me how to do it maybe I'm just not doing it right uh, you can tell me how to change it but uh, because I want to show you I like this let me see I gotta go back and bring this back up here to see where where was that right here let's see now see right there this is my old menu see how pretty this looks and it's got the green highlight bar in it and there's no dark in it I got it's got a nice uh, round menu box it's got the little opening they've been talking about between the, the panel and the menu box and uh, that lets your your uh, wallpaper your desktop wallpaper show through we've got a nice round uh, search bar you know with the rounded corners on it and I really like this so I don't think I'm going to be upgrading anytime soon because I like the way this looks and I just don't uh, I just don't believe that I can drop this setting right away now that I've got it uh, even Warpinator box just about anything that's a native Linux Mint uh, uh, program will, will show up in this collar and I do, I've just taken a liking to it and I've always wanted, I want to get away from those white boxes there for some time. So I don't think I'll be upgrading probably for a little while. I like this okay, but I just also like what I got. And <clears throat> I hope either somebody can tell me what I'm doing wrong. That's why I can't get rid of that dark color, the darkness behind here, and the dark and the dark highlighter here. If they change that, then I'll like it even better and be more apt to switch. Uh, like I say, I... I like it okay it's not that I don't like it but uh, for what I'm seeing here and from what I would get out of it I don't and I'm usually quick to change I I change pretty fast usually so uh, okay thank you for watching the video uh, thank you for dropping in and and uh, checking out the channel and being here as we look at this new menu for uh, Linux Mint Cinnamon 22.3 and uh, you have a good rest of your day